Hey, hey, hey. Hi, guys. I want to make sure that you guys can hear me, that everything sounds and looks good. Hey, guys. I just want to make sure that you guys can hear me, that you guys can, I know you guys can see me. Hey, hey, uh, thanks guys for being here. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Okay, <laughs> I'm so happy to be here. Hey, I see Lori, I see Liz, Molly, Willard. Oh no, I hope you feel better, Willard, I'm sorry. Samantha, Ivy, I don't know if I know your name too well yet, but welcome, I'm so happy you're here. Conley's here. My sisters are here. Eileen and Denise are my sisters. You might be able to meet them when we do the 1,000 subscriber celebration. Woohoo! Hey, girl. Hey, Miss Canadian Bacon. Abigail. Oh, thank you, Abigail. That's so sweet. I really appreciate that. Oh, I'm so excited. Hey, Betsy. Hi, Eileen. Are you still recovering from the Chantecai sale? <laughs> Oh man, we were talking until very late. Um, we did some major damage. So, ooh, you like the lip? You like the eye? I'm so excited to actually wear this. I was just telling my my daughter in law, we were I was getting ready and she was here just with me, and I'm like, you know what? I don't care. I wear this every day, all day around my house in my PJs. I don't give a shit, you know, it, it is what it is. It's beautiful. And it is the Patrick Ta. And this is in the shade. Oh, oh no, she's not from here. So it's a really beautiful, like, I just hauled it a couple videos ago. Again, I think a couple lives ago, actually. And it's with the Gucci, the matte formula. No, I wish. Is Velvet Morning, um, is that Lisa Eldridge, friend? Is that Lisa Eldridge? This is Gucci. This is Agatha Orange in the matte formula. Oh my God, it is just divine. I think it's beautiful. Oh, thank you. I would. I think you've asked me this before, doll. I'm sorry. I think I can totally do a hair tutorial. I have to tell you guys something like, this is so important actually, because um, I'm gonna link the lip, Betsy. Sorry, I'm unprepared. I only link the stuff that's in the giveaway, but I'll link what I'm wearing in case you guys are interested in checking it out. Um, you know, I think in general, I'm 39 years old, and so I'm coming into my own, like I'm coming in into my own skin. I feel comfortable, I feel confident. Like, I don't take my value from, you know, how many compliments I get or how many subscribers I have. And I think it's serving so many different purposes. Like. I'm finding the most genuine, authentic people, regardless of subscriber count. Um, and then I'm also learning how to feel better about myself, but it's still hard. It's still hard. So I want to say this. Um, I have really thin, thin hair and it's kind of the way I curl it. But a couple weeks ago, I took out my extensions and I felt so horrible. I felt so self-conscious and literally that first video, Somebody was like, oh my gosh, did you cut your hair? Oh my God, I love it. And I was like, what? It's so thin and so like, ugh, like wilty looking. I don't know. I felt so self-conscious. And so more and more people have been asking about my hair. And I'm like, you know, I still believe in like doing the things that make you feel confident and comfortable. And like, I love my Botox. I'm not even going to lie. I did love my extensions. And I'm just taking a break because it's been about a year. But I just... It kind of just reminds me like it's not the compliments that are making me feel better about it, but it just reminds me like, you know, confidence comes from within, not from the way we look. And even at 39 years old, that's still something that I'm learning. And so I just want to put it out there because I think it's important to realize that like at the end of the day, like this is all just makeup. You know, my mom used to say it's all vanity, whatever. But it's about, you know, really finding a way to feel confident in who you are. And so anyway, hello, Gigi Beauty. Hello, Janelle, Susanna. Oh my God, I know the other Gucci lipstick that I'm totally obsessing about. 
um, is again, the Gucci matte formula and Sophie Plum. It's so beautiful. You guys, it's the purple that I wore to the last like haul live. So it's just really beautiful. Yeah, exactly. So it's like, we're our own worst critics sometimes. And it's like, you know, this always happens, but sometimes I can hear people just being so self-deprecating. I'm like, what are you talking about? Like you are, you looked so beautiful or, you know, whatever. Sometimes it's hard for us to accept compliments because we feel a certain way about ourselves. And it's, I don't know. I always say that here on my channel, you know, it's a place where we can feel comfortable, where it doesn't matter what you look like, what age you are, what shade you are, you know, what works for you, what doesn't like, this is a place where makeup enthusiasts get together, we unwind, we have a good time, we just talk about what we're passionate about. And um, I think that that's important. You know, I'd like to keep that community going. Um, it's not, it's not a place, and I was just talking to Kara about this actually, Beauty and the Frizz, where, you know, we're so excited about like the plans we have for our channel, especially going into December, where we are going to be posting a little bit more, but it's like we're getting more into like the creative side of makeup because I think even for our viewers, sometimes overconsumption can be a little exhausting. And so I'm always going to buy new makeup, but I just, you know, it has to be a place where we feel comfortable to just play and just be who we are. So anyway, boom, I need to stop preaching up in here, but somebody needed to hear it. Okay, I think that there's something about your 30s that changes your perspective on life. I, I think that's true, Betsy. And I think that, man, I'll write a book one day. I was I was actually talking to Samantha March. She's just very sweet. She's a very real person. I was like, girl, if you knew, like, I can write a book. and it's not like, you know, uh, boo hoo play the violin for me book, but sometimes it's been really, really hard. And those things really kind of mold you into who you're supposed to be. But when did I start Botox? I started Botox uh, about a year ago, actually a year and a half ago in May of um, 2018, I believe. Best decision I ever made. I love it. Um, I actually need to go in for a refresher right now, but I'm I'm letting it go a little bit longer. You guys see those lines there? I'm letting it go a little bit longer because I'm testing my Shantifex. You know what I'm saying? I'm putting it to the test. So yeah, I love Botox. I think it's wonderful. Um, yeah. Uh, Luna, hola, bella. ¿Cómo estás? Thank you for being here, amiga. Let me see. Oh, you just saw the... <laughs> I shouldn't have put the names down, but we're going to go through it. We're going to talk about it. Yes, you just saw the list of goodies. Um, there's a lot of good shit in there. I'm <laughs> saying there's a lot of good stuff in there. Oh, hi, Lena. How are you? <laughs> Denise is my sister. Lena is my friend. Uh, we've been friends maybe since we were like, they might have been 10. Denise and Lena might have been 10. I was a year younger, but they are lifelong friends. And Thanks for being here with me. <laughs> I always feel silly when people that know me know me in person, like see me here because I'm just like, Ugh. you know, this is who I am <laughs> and they cannot let me tell a lie. This is who I am. <laughs> yep. So here we go. Yes. I'm all about using makeup. We already have. Uh, first of all, if you guys are not following Monica on Instagram, please go do that. She is just lovely. This girl is not only gorgeous on the outside, but she's so, so smart. She breaks the politics of makeup down. She breaks these amazing looks down. Like she provides a lot of resources and I just like enjoy this girl so much. And I think we've quickly become, you know, very nice friends. And so I'm so excited for Monica. I think she's adorable. I love her. Go follow her. I the BK beauty. I am BK beauty. Let me see. I am BK. Oh yes. I'm going to tell you a story when I get to that one. Oh, I'm not going to cry, but like, uh, I'm just, yeah, I'm very excited to be here. I want Botox to erase my, yeah. And you know what? I, I think, um, I don't know if I agree with starting Botox in your twenties, but like for sure, as soon as you start to see some, um, uh, creasing or lines or whatever, I would, I would. Yeah. Here we go. Look at, I want to show you guys. Okay. So you guys don't know, but like, 
when the giveaway ends, which we're gonna open it up for a generous amount of time, we're gonna have the most amazing 1,000 subscriber celebration. Um, I actually got that idea from Bray Clark, who's also a good friend of mine. And um, yeah, I just want an opportunity for you guys to meet like the people that keep me uh, going when it's really, really hard. Um, and Al Feisty has literally been there from the day before I started my channel. And I just love her so much. She's the best. Go check her out because she has the most amazing luxury channel as well. She just posted a really amazing skincare video today. So definitely go check that out. Exactly. There's nothing wrong with Botox. Hola, Steffi Glam. What up, girl? We love seeing you here. And hi, Lena. I see you now. Thank you. Thank you for being here. I appreciate it. Yes, the BK brushes are the best. Rupi. Okay, go watch Rupi. She is the most, uh, she's in Canada, but she is just so generous. She's so supportive. She is just like somebody that we've gotten really, really close to very, very quickly because of her genuine and sweet heart. And I just love her. She has a really cool channel. My sister was telling me the other day that she really enjoys your channel, Rupi. So and we have Vicky J. Vicky J, another one. Look at this gorgeousness. Just so, I love you guys. Thank you. Uh, to my co um, creator community, like, man, just the fact that we can sit here and be friends and support each other. And like, you know, um, Beauty and the First was just talking about this at the, on her video today. Um, and she's like, you know, we're busy sometimes. Like, this is a no pressure zone. You don't have to sit there and watch all my videos or this or that. But it's more than that. Like, I feel like we've become friends with a lot of creators that we've come across. And it's just a beautiful thing because we're here to answer questions for one another. Like, we're all learning different things every day. And so I just, I love what we're finding here. I love that even if you guys don't have channels, like, I don't know, like you guys go and check out all these other channels because I love to do collabs. So um, yeah, it's been a really, really rewarding um, experience for me. And it's one that I desperately needed. And I think like, especially going into 2021, you'll learn a lot more about why this is just such a very special place for me. So I'm not gonna get like too crazy or whatever, but yeah, exactly. See this light? Yes. And so if you have a channel, and I think I've pretty much just called out everybody, but if you have a channel, please, please make sure and let us know in the chat because people will watch the replay. And I think it's important. Like I, you know, I, I open it up to that. I want everybody to know about all of us because I can't be all things to everyone and vice versa. And so I think it's really, really good. So yeah, so we're excited to be here. So let's just stop yapping our mouth and like, um, let's take a drink. Cheers. Cheers to all of you. I, uh, yeah, cheers. I'm drinking some Prosecco. Mm. What are you guys drinking? Tell me what you guys are drinking. Love it, love it. Yadi <laughs> Yadi has a dope community. Well, you're part of my community. All of you are part of my community. And you know what? It happened one at a time. I think it started with all feisty and then beauty in the frizz and it happened one at a time. And we just started like meeting more and more people that were interested in starting a channel that just were wild, crazy about makeup that were teaching us about makeup because I'm just like not that good with like launches and everything else yet. And it, we just, I don't know, like we just, started to create this amazing community. And then, you know, for a minute, I was a little concerned because I'm like, I'm doing a lot of collabs, but like, I love sharing other channels with the people that are subscribed to me. Like, for instance, we see a lot of different skin tones here, a lot of different ages. There's people that are into luxury beauty. There's people that are into indie makeup and duochromes and all this different stuff. And I'm like, I, you know, people watching me, if they're into this, I want them to find these channels. So anyway, anyway, anyway. You got your hair cut. You should grab something, Ruby. I'm just saying. Like, if we were, like, together right now, I'd be pouring you a drink, honey. And my sisters and Lena on here can tell you I'm kind of a bad influence. Grab a drink, honey. Grab a drink. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So, Michelle, oh, here, let me. 
He's saying we collaborated with Michelle Wong. Uh, you know what? Um, we we did a video. This is what I mean about this community. We did a video, Susanna's idea, Susanna Torres. We did a video about things that Michelle Wong had made us buy. And then like, we never expected her to see our video or anything like that. Well, weeks later, because she's very busy, she found us, she followed us on Instagram and um, on our YouTube channels. And I just have been blown away by her humility, her beautiful heart. And I just like, that's what I mean. Like you guys are in the right place, man, right place. Look at this girl. That's what I'm saying. We need to hang out, girl. We need to hang out. <gasps> Vicky J. Vow. Vow. I, I just moved to Dallas a year ago. I don't believe that they understand. I don't want to offend anybody from Dallas. I don't think they understand what carne asada really is. Um, so we're really looking forward to going to California in December. <laughs> Oh, yeah, that was fun. That was so much fun. Yeah, we did um, a collab on four Sicily shades with four beautiful women on Instagram. And I thought that was so adorable. I loved it. All right. Oh, you found me through Michelle Wong too, Monica. That's awesome. You definitely, um, Monica, you definitely have to check out Susanna Torres. I think you would love her. You would love it, honey. ¿Qué vino es el que tomo? No es vino. No es vino, reina. Déjame enseñarte. So es, um, es como cham champagne, pero es Prosecco. You know, en Costco. Es que lo venden en Costco. It's fine. Not my preferred brand of Prosecco, but it's fine. It will do. Y después le echo nomás un poquitito de Chambord. Y queda dulce, pero no tan dulce. Uh, como con un sabor como de uva. It's uh, very, very yummy. I love it. I love it, honey. I want to say hi and congrats. Oh, thank you, Veronese. Thank you so much. Um, yeah. Awesome. Hey, okay. So, again, for people that know me in real life that are watching or whatnot, like you guys know, like Yadi does not like usually do things small, but I, we're coming across this more and more. And between like Al Feisty and Beauty in the Frizz and um, Kelly from Keep Beauty Real, like we had all just been talking for a while. It's been months where we were like, hey, what if we put together like some type of like, you know, not small YouTuber convention or like conference or whatever, but um, just something where we can get together for a couple of days, just kind of rant and talk, you know, commiserate about how hard it is to be on YouTube and just kind of hang out, share some tips, share some tricks. Well, this came up on Brit's live the other night. I was on her channel and I'm like, okay, it's not impossible. So if I'm planning something for 2021, so I'm just saying like, uh, I would love to coordinate something for all of us ladies to get together. No pressure. Whoever comes, comes. You know, we're going to bring our drinks, our makeup, hang out, learn about each other, learn how to grow, how to support each other. I'm just saying stay tuned because this is just the beginning, honey. Just the beginning. All right. Yay, Monica, you're going to totally enjoy Susanna, I promise you. Okay, what's on my eyes today? We have on my eyes today the child. The child, as Beauty in the First likes to say, the child. Look at how beautiful that is. I hate that it's color pop, but like, look at the mirror, how cute. It's color pop. There's been like five other releases after this came out, but it's so pretty. It's so pretty. And then you look at this just deep, deep chocolate brown. Like they're just so good, you guys. I wish that wasn't the case because they piss me off sometimes, but it's so yummy and delicious. And um, if I get my shipment in time, there might be one in the giveaway, but we don't know that yet. So I will keep you guys notified of that. There's this matte with shimmers in there. I learned from the Tati Beauty palette that she had created like the sequence formula that was matte with shimmers in it. But then as soon as you started blending, the shimmers went away. This doesn't go away. It's an amazing formula. So anyway, just wanted to let you guys know. Hello, beautiful. My makeup in the house. Adorable. 
Kiran is here. Did I say that right? Kiran is here. Dahlia's here. Thanks, guys. You guys are adorable. Yeah. <laughs> Girl, it's my favorite things. My favorite things. So let me just show you. Let's stop yapping our mouth and let's go for it, okay? So I want to tell you about the giveaway. I had been preparing for a long time. I'm all about speaking the promises. I'm all about calling things into existence. So I started shopping for my 1,000 subscriber giveaway a long time ago. And yeah, I just got really good stuff. I, it's a box really of all my favorite things. So that's what you will find. So let's go ahead and get started. Uh, my 10 year old Goots, he helped me with some totals. And so we'll just kind of go through it and then we'll total it up. I will tell you at the end what the rules for the giveaway are and we'll just go from there. If you guys have questions, let's just kind of chit chat through the comments and we'll just do that. Let me see, so much more powerful. What's so much more powerful, Monica? Oh, the, the child, yeah, it's beautiful, guys. It, it it really is. And I feel like right now the lights are kind of washing me out a little bit, but it is good, good. Veronese, my passion is makeup. I'm 50 years old with hooded eyes and makeup makes me feel centered and beautiful. Oh, I love it. I love that, Veronese. And you are cute. Look at you. I see your picture. That's adorable. I am 39. I have three boys, 21, 14, and 10. And I hear you. I hear you. I love, love makeup. Uh, sometimes I'll just come in here at night and just start swatching away if I've had a rough day or whatever. I just love it. So. I have some coffee, so excited. <laughs> Thank you, Mo. I know, 1,000 subscribers. Um, sometimes people are like, oh, you know, a smaller channel, or I don't have a lot of subscribers. Bullshit, because at the end of the day, it's a 1,000 people that decided to give you a little bit of their time each day or every time that you upload a video, and to me, that's a huge deal. Like, I still get excited every time I see my subscriber count go up by one. That's a whole life that decided to subscribe to you, to give you time, to engage with you, and like, for me, like, that's a, that's a huge, huge deal, so. Thank you, Mo. I appreciate it. So we're going to start with, um, I didn't do skincare and I couldn't do complexion, even though those are two of like my absolute favorite things because I don't know who's going to win. And so how do I buy complexion products or skincare if I don't know what their skin concerns are and that sort of thing? So um, do you have a ride or die brand or do you just love luxury stuff in general? Um, okay, so this is a good question. I would say... I don't, I have to say that in terms of eyeshadow, like the brands that are just consistently always, always, always good in my opinion are Dior and Pat McGrath. Like I just never have had a dud in my opinion. When it comes to like skincare and complexion and stuff like that, like the brand that's really killing it for me right now is Shantakai. And I just like, I have to be mindful to not always make it like a Shantakai commercial, but that's just where I'm at right now. And yeah, they're pretty much at the top. Like I'm just really loving them. But I also like I was talking to my daughter in law, like elf kills it for me every single time. I don't care if I paid $4 for that setting spray, like they are killing it for me. And I I'm going to be honest about that, you know. So yeah, I see the La review de esa paleta o me la perdí. No, de la child. No, no, no. Pero si la quieres, la hago sin problemas. Claro que sí. Yeah, she's talking about the ColourPop. She wants to know if I'm going to do a review on it. I totally can. That's no problem. Let's see. Just popping in and say congratulations. Thank you, Kay Bella. Love you. Yeah, exactly. Monica says it perfectly. It's a whole life that decided to give me some of their time, that's huge for me. So anyway, I'm very, very grateful. Let's go ahead and get started and we'll just start telling everything up. So the first product that's in here, and again, one of my favorites, I talked about these during my Sephora recommendations, are the Shiseido Facial Cottons. I hate that I'm putting this in a giveaway box because I'm gonna ruin you for life once you try these. They're so, so good. You're not gonna wanna buy the cotton rounds at Walmart. They're so, so yummy. Has anybody tried these? Pat McGrath is everything, yeah. <laughs> Just so you guys know, like everybody laughs when I say this, I have been known to set an entire face of luxury makeup with e.l.f. powder. It is what it is, honey. If it's good, it's good. Okay, so Shiseido cotton rounds or cotton squares, 
These are so good. They don't leave lint behind. They they don't fall apart on you. I like to use these in the morning when I just go in with micellar water if I'm not going to wash my face, and it just cleans it off really, really nicely. I think these are really nice. I would love for somebody to try these. I've probably ruined you for life to whoever wins this. Just saying. These retail for $12. So we're going to keep a tally of how much is in the box. So $12. Then the next item, there's going to be some extra gifts here too that I've just received, like not in PR, but gifted from brands. So I, I guess PR, but yeah, I, I won't add those. I'll show them at the end. Vicky J, the cottons are truth. Yes, girl. I <laughs> What a snob. <laughs> Just like me, like I can't use anything else. And I heard on um, Al Feisty's skincare video today, she's like, you know, she's like, I really like the Shiseido cotton squares. However, like, I, you know, she showed us the clay to Poe ones. And she's like, they're the same company or something, she said. But she's like, you know, the way I see it is like Shiseido can Toyota clay to Poe Lexus. And I'm like, ah, I got to talk. I got to try those now. <laughs> But yeah, we're, we got some, some cotton snobbery going on in here. I, I will admit. I will admit. <laughs> okay, next. So again, th this is going to be a box of my favorite things. Some things, maybe my favorite brand, um, and I just had purchased a double because it was a very exciting release, and I wanted somebody to experience that. So I'm going to be honest, like, not my favorite highlighter, but it is one of my favorite brands. So the next one is a very exciting one. It's the Pat McGrath Skin Fetish Highlighter. This is the new highlighter that was just released. And I'm not going to open it, but I'll just take it out of the box so you guys can see. If you haven't seen my review, you'll go check that out. But look at this gorgeousness. This is like the most expensive paperweight you've ever had in your life. It is so, so heavy, you guys. I mean, like, I don't know. For the for the ones that have it in the group, like, how much do you think this weighs? Like, it has to be at least a pound, but it's so beautiful. It's gold-plated. It's mirrored. And there's a highlighter in here. I'm not going to open it, but you can go check out my review. I do have a review up on my channel of this. So, <laughs> sorry, Vicky J. Now she's like, I have to go try the clay to pull. <laughs> oh, man. We're going to screw ourselves, Vicky, because you know we're going to love it. And so then we're going to screw ourselves. All right. The next thing. Ooh, I want to leave this till the end. That one's good. Okay. I did tell you guys about this. Uh, Lisa Eldridge lipstick. I am loving, loving, loving Lisa Eldridge lipsticks. It's the velvet formula, the velvet matte. And you're going to get a really beautiful velvet pouch. And inside, the shade that you are getting is the velvet muse, which is just really really beautiful you can see the name there and it's a really pretty like pinky nude color um they retail for 38 dollars i think it's 26 pounds so maybe 38 dollars. that's what we'll call it because the pouch is included there and so that's included into the giveaway so we have 55 we have 12 dollars plus 55 plus 38 and then next i also have a review of this I should have pulled the products, you guys. Oh, my God. Eight to ten ounces. Yeah. No. Oh, hi, Lisa J. How are you? Oh, I'm so excited. You're coming up, actually, doll. Hold on a second. I just have to show you guys this because I want you guys to get excited if you haven't seen these, but it's the Natasha Denona Mini Sendo. Um, I had a re I have a review up on my channel. It's such a beautiful, beautiful quint, the mattes and the shimmers just blend out beautifully. And so one of these will be included into the giveaway. So I'm going to add that. that. That retails for $25. And then, again, these are all my favorite things. So I've talked about this in a skincare video where when it comes to sheet masks, these are the ones that have just stood out to me. This is the sheet mask that you will wear like 
right before a wedding or a very, very special occasion where you just want to just glow and just glow from within and look beautiful. Makeup is going to apply flawlessly. Like that's where you're going to wear this. This, I think a five pack retails for $125. I've purchased a five pack a couple times. Um, so I included one of these because I absolutely love it and I want somebody to have it. So I'm including that. So plus $25, then, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. You guys already know, but let me just open it up. One of the most popular and most beautiful palettes this year, the Tiny Marvels palette from Sydney Grace. This was a collaboration with Mel Thompson. And if you don't know about Mel Thompson here on YouTube, like I feel like when it comes to complexion and just eyeshadow looks, like she just kills it. Um, I just think that we must have similar skin because we just, um, everything she recommends, I love. And so I wanted to include that. It was a very popular palette. It just blends seamlessly. I love it. And so I wanted it to be in there. Oh, Lisa J. Yes, you do, honey. It is such a pretty color story. Look at this. And again, I have a review on my channel, but like, let me just show you the one color that I felt was so unique that I hadn't seen too much of was this one. And look at how that swatches. I just think it's so pretty. It's very, very nice. It just, it really does blend beautifully. So anyway, yes, those masks are amazing. Yes. Oh no, I'm not done. There's a lot guys. There's a lot. All right, so the next thing that is one of my favorites, does anybody know what my favorite Tom Ford quad is? If you do, please answer down below. What is my favorite Tom Ford quad? Sorry, I just have to, while you guys are thinking, get myself a refresher. I don't have a bartender tonight, so does anybody know what my favorite Tom Ford quad is? Everyone's, <laughs> hey, Liz Dagger Beauty. You guys, go and check this girl out on Instagram. Um, she does the most amazing swatches ever. Like she will do Instagram live videos and um, literally we just sit there and watch her pretty nail polish and watch her swatch. <laughs> and we're just sitting there drooling. She's amazing, go check her out. We may or may not see her on our channel pretty soon. So yes, get excited. Yes, my absolute favorite, favorite quad is the Double Indemnity by Tom Ford. And I'm including one here because I just think it's so beautiful. I'm not going to open it again. I'm so sorry that I was ill prepared. I should have had my um, copy of this just hanging out so I could show you guys the color story. But I have a video on this. Actually, we have a subscriber here in the chat. I hope she's still on Janelle, but she just reached out and I was so flattered because at the time I had like maybe 200, 300 subscribers and she was like, hey, I hope I'm not being too forward, but can you do a review on these Tom Ford quads? I got a bunch for my birthday. I'm so excited. And I said, yes, I can. Yes, I can. <laughs> a request from somebody I don't know. And so um, I one of the quads in that video was the double indemnity. I just think it's so perfect for date night. It can be smoky. It can be light. They come in the wet dry formula. And so I absolutely love this. This retails for $88 and I need somebody to have this. Like I think beauty in the frizz here, she picked it up because I told her how much I loved it and she loves it too. It's just amazing. So we're going to include that. We have mini Zendo. Oh, okay. So you guys know that on my channel and on Instagram, like the biggest thing that um, I think the most important thing to me is to be kind, is to be uplifting and encouraging and loving to one another. Um, on my mom's, was it, I think it was on Mother's Day. Was it on Mother's Day? It was either on Mother's Day or on my mom's anniversary of her passing. I think it was that. It was in August. Um, I had seen a beauty community tag floating around. Kerasi was the creator of that tag. And basically she was like, who's the creator that makes me laugh the most? Who's the creator that I laugh from the most? Those sort of things. And um, there was a Good Vibes creator, you know, Samantha Marge. And so 
Um, I wanted to do that in honor of my mom because one of the things that was just so true to who my mom was is she was kind. She was so beautiful because of how much she loved others. And so, um, yeah. So when I, I had been watching this lady for quite a while, and at the time, I just, for one reason or another, had never picked up some of her product. And then my friend Britt Clark came up with, she was offered a collaboration with BK Beauty. And she curated her own bundle. And we were all so proud. We wanted to just cheer Britt on. We wanted to just kind of let her know how proud we were of her. And everybody, you know, a lot of creators started picking up these bundles and sharing it with their audience. And so it really became a big thing. And I think it was so successful that they even, um, extended the brush bundle set. And so during that time, I picked up my bundle set. I did have a couple videos where I featured these brushes and I was just so, so uh, impressed. And I wanted to share it with the world because I'm a walking billboard and you already know. So um, I started talking about these brushes. I love these brushes so much. At the time, I think I had like maybe four or 500 subscribers and I had just tagged Lisa J and I said, hey, I really like your brushes in like one of my stories. And I said, I'm gonna pick up another one so that I can give away on my 1000 subscriber giveaway. And literally the next thing that she messaged me was like, nope, nope, mm -mm. let me send you one for your 1000 subscriber giveaway. And so she sent me one and this was a couple months ago and I just like, those little things mean a lot, Lisa, and I think that they just speak exactly to who you are and your heart and how kindness is really just your mission. And I think that's why you're seeing so much success because people know you, people know that that's what you stand for. And I just love, love that so much. So if you didn't know, BK Beauty stands for Beauty is Kindness. And um, I just think that her and her husband could not be any kinder, any sweeter. They just support the community because she's a content creator. She understands how hard it is to do this. And so it just means the world to me. Thank you for believing in me. Thank you for, yeah, I mean, the first thing that I think some people would think is like, she has 500 subscribers, like give her another six to nine months. You know, it takes a long time, but she didn't care. She didn't, like, she didn't see the value that I brought in the amount of subscribers. She just wanted to do something kind. And so I really, really appreciate that. I just, it's a good thing that they're really, really good because <laughs> I really, really love them. They're one of my favorite, favorite things. And they're going into the 1000 subscriber giveaway. This is the Brick Clark bundle set. It retails for $95. It's no longer available. So like maybe it will come back. We'll see. It was wildly popular. So um, yeah, we're very excited. So very, very thankful to Lisa J who um, helped us with this bundle set. All right. Next we have a Surat Auto Graphique eyeliner plus refill this is uh it retails for 42 dollars. <laughs> i think you guys saw in my instagram stories a month or two ago i was freaking out i went back for a ton because i got them for a really great price but this eyeliner is amazing it's what i'm wearing today it's very matte it's very black and i absolutely love it and um yeah you're getting one of these in your box this is 42 dollars I only own three items from Syrah and it's the eyeliner. I have a lid lacquer, which I'm playing with. I think it's really interesting. It's like the wet eyeshadow type of look. And then I also have um, a brush. And so, so far so good. I know that Kinky Sweat really loves Syrah. And so I'm experimenting with the brand, but I did love the eyeliner so much that I wanted to include one in the giveaway. That one retails for $42. Sorry, I'm just... Uh adding things up here. Then, oh, I have to open this, guys. You guys, I'm not gonna open it. I'm so sorry to be so ill-prepared, but I have to show you. There's a couple of eyeshadow formulas that I absolutely love. I like to research, I like to make sure that I come prepared, <laughs> except today, <laughs> and I wanna give you all the information. Like, I wanna show you if these products really work because I do tend to focus more on um, luxury beauty. And so those items are pricey. And so I wanna be able to provide value and give you the right reviews, give you all the information so that if you choose 
to purchase that product, if you're in the market for the product, then um, you are going to be happy or satisfied or have given a very accurate representation of what the product will provide. And so recently I had a video on my channel and I was so happy. I was so excited. I just could not. So um, I was coming in thinking that it was not going to work for my medium skin tone. And I was so pleasantly surprised. Um, I had actually, to be honest, rushed to go get it, um, even though I had one in, on the way as well. But I wanted to get my review up as quickly as possible for everybody that was shopping the Sephora sale. And I'm talking about this one here. The Natasha Denona Trio Chrome Palette. I just love it so much, you guys, that I have to share it with somebody. They are beautiful. In my video, in my review, what you saw is that I was going to put it to the test. I wanted to create smoky looks that would work on deeper skin tones because it looked like a bunch of pastels. And I mean, I can understand why people felt that way. Like it looked like pastels. And so we um, started playing with it. I did one look with each row. And what I found is that we can definitely smoke it out and that it looked really, really nice. And so I know that Monica on here, actually, Monica, go check her out on Instagram. She had a really beautiful post about this palette and created some crazy looks that were just gorgeous um, for shade reference. Because again, that's what we're here for. We wanna create you know, a diverse resource of shades. Um, but I loved it so much that I just said, you know what? It retails for $129, but I already had one on the way when I purchased this at Sephora. And so I said, you know what? Screw it. Let's just leave it in the giveaway because I want somebody else to have it. So it's in the giveaway. Here it is. It's a very, very well, well protected. Um, so we're gonna we're gonna give it to somebody in this giveaway. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna add $129. And then there's another favorite thing that I have, but I'm gonna save that towards the end. Now this shade, um, I think is iconic. I don't, I don't necessarily love the shade, but I wanted to provide just something that was kind of a, um, a cult favorite. Um, I love the formula and that's what I love. And so it is the Charlotte Tilbury Lip Cheat in Pillow Talk. And, um, you know, Pillow Talk is kind of like their claim to fame. Everybody loves it. I think it works for most skin types. I just don't like like the pinky pinky, but I love this formula and I have a few of these lip liners. And so I thought that I would include it because um, I think that somebody will really, really love this. This retails, I think, for 30. No, no, no. Is it 25 or 32 dollars? I think it's let me look on my notes here. Charlotte Tilbury, 25 dollars. So we're going to add that to the giveaway because the formula is really, really good. And everybody seems to love that color. So I just want to put it on there so that somebody can enjoy it. Um, the next thing that is one of my favorites um, until I found, well, I use Dr. Broner's and this, but it is the Beauty Blender, the solid to wash your brushes and sponges. I really enjoy this. You just run it underwater, you swirl your brushes in there or your sponge and it cleans it so, so nicely. And I recently picked one up and I wanted to get another one for you guys. Um, this one is the solid lavender and it does include the silicone scrub mat. So I think you guys will really, really like this. Um, this one retails for $16 and you know, sometimes we get so used to washing our brushes a certain way that I just thought it'd be cool to share somebody what I love. And so we're gonna add that. Another thing that we have here is, y'all know, I mean, I've been very honest about the fact that I have really large pores here and I have to work really, really hard um, to hide those. And so before my YSL Two Chaclat, and now I feel really bad because now I want to go add a YSL Two Chaclat to this giveaway. But before that, there was two primers that I kind of went to for poor minimizing, poor blurring. And so I instantly picked those up when I had an opportunity to because I just really like them. And one of them is the Professional Primer. Um, this was probably a staple for a couple of years. And it was always between this one and between the Smashbox primers. And so I wanted to add those two in because, again, pores are an issue for me, honey. And if they are for you, for whoever wins, I think you'll really, really love these. Um, this one, I think, retails for 
$32. And then we have the Smashbox that retails for $28. And so I wanted to add those two. Give them a try if you like them. I think that you will really love them. Um, I know, you guys. I'm a little extra. Listen, my sisters are on here. They know, I guess, um, if I have something good, I want you guys to experience it too. And so like for me, it's like I didn't buy it all at once. I just bought it knowing that I was going to stick with it and I was going to reach a thousand subscribers. And I wanted to share my favorites with people that I love, which are all of you. And so it is a little bit, it's a nice giveaway, but I just want you guys to enjoy it too. And so that's why I'm doing it. Um, the next one is one of my favorite glosses. Um, I don't, I feel like it's underrated and that kind of pisses me off sometimes. And I do feel that it's very comparable to the Wayne Goss lip glosses, but I'm talking about the Shiseido Lacquer Ink Lip Shine. This lip gloss is bomb, you guys, bomb. You guys are going to love it. I picked it up when I bought my Shiseido foundation, but it's in such a beautiful, like nude shade that I think any um, skin tone can wear beautifully over a liner or whatever. And I've used, I've gone through like maybe three or four of these. So I really, really love these. And I wanted to include one. This one I think retails for $35. So we're going to add that because that's a good one. And I'm going to take a break. I have three more items that are really, really good. And I just want to see what everybody's talking about. Yes. The Natasha Denona. Let's see here. Surat Drew Dot Drew Do Drop Foundation. Ooh, I've never tried that. That sounds fun. I might have to. I might have to. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. I it is a nice giveaway. Again, I just started this thinking. I want to make sure that if I like something and it's on my channel and I'm ranting and raving about how beautiful it is, like I'm not clueless. Listen. My sisters are on this chat with me. Like we grew up, our parents were ministers. We grew up in a very humble home. We didn't have a lot. And so now like we've just been so blessed. And so to me, it's just like, I can't sit here and tell you how much I love it. Knowing that there's people that are watching that, like, you know, that's just not an attainable thing at the moment. And I know what's going on in our world. And so for me, it was just, I kept telling everybody like, share, 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 please share. I want to send this box before Christmas. Like how cool would it be if somebody gets to open this box for Christmas and just have a good time? And so, I don't know, that's kind of the premise behind it, but hmm, my mom, she taught us how to be like that. And if you meet my sisters, which I hope you will meet my sisters for my 1000 subscriber celebration giveaway announcement, you're going to see like they have such a beautiful spirit. And so you'll love them. All right. Who was the brand that I fell in love on YouTube? Does anybody know? Like I just went nuts and I was like, oh, I've never tried them. I need everything in their line. Like, do you guys remember who that was? Do you guys remember? Let me see. Does anybody remember who was the brand that I fell in love with? Oh, Betsy, thank you, love. Same. Did too. Ditto. My sister loves you, Betsy. I think I told you that the other day. My sister was like, she's so good. We love you. <laughs> Ooh. It's kind of not fair because she's my sister, but she, yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Mama pet. Mama pet. I fell in love with her on YouTube. Like you guys witnessed me falling in love with her. I felt so freaking hard. You guys, she don't even know it, but she has hit like on a couple of my Instagram posts. So that kind of means that we're friends. So anyway, just um, want you guys to know if you ever need an introduction. So uh, the first item that we have is um, something that I really, really love from her line, which is her Matte Lux Transformula. The shade that I picked up was some, something pretty neutral that anybody could use. Again, it has to be a box that's friendly for any skin tone or most skin tones. I think this one will be. It's in the shade 410 Lavish. And again, matte transformula. I'm not going to open this because that would be weird. Uh, 
But just so you guys know, I am currently digging the Lisa Eldridge Velvet Matte Formula quite a bit. But like Mama Pat, like this lady don't play. She does not play. It's the most yummy and beautiful matte formula ever. And I'm just, I'm in love. Like, yeah, there's other really good ones, but like she's really, really bomb too. You know what I'm saying? So definitely, I'm looking around. Sorry, guys. Definitely um, something that we really, really like. So, oh my God, of course, Lori, duh. She, I mean, we, we talk quite a bit, I'm just saying, but yeah, duh, we are friends, totally friends. <laughs> I'm a little crazy, Liz. I don't know if you want to be my friend, but you're stuck now because we friends, honey, we friends. I'm a little crazy, but it's okay. It's okay. People love crazy sometimes. <laughs> Anyway, yeah, so her matte Lux Transformula is what we have here. This is in the shade 410, which is lavish. It is gorgeous. The formula is beautiful. It's long lasting. It's a yummy, creamy matte, and it retails for $38. Um, am I right, um, Kara? Am I right? Like, I think it's $38 or $36. So we're going to put that in because that's one of my favorite matte formulas gucci is giving it a run for its money so yes and then we have what we have the final item and then just like a little extra a couple extra little gifts that i'm going to throw in there because literally nothing else would fit in the box and so let me just you guys see you used to be able to see like the um my little area back there because that's how much i love mama pat so let me just do this. Let me see which one are we. Let's give the girls this one. So um, I bought all of the Divine Rose collection. I just loved it so much. I thought it was so beautiful. And that was like my introduction into Mama Pat. But Divine Rose too was the one that would just, you know, kind of made the, the girls go crazy, you know, got their panties in a twist. And with good reason, the one that everybody went super, super nuts about was the Sextra Terrestrial that, um, who was it? Was it Michelle Wong that like, <laughs> she would just laugh like a little teenager when she would say Sextra Terrestrial. It is just the most beautiful of the collection, in my opinion. This one here, don't be fooled. It's pink, but it's green, but it's gold. I mean, there's so much going on. It has such a beautiful, beautiful color story. The best of the collection, if you're asking me. Um, and then it has this really amazing shade that everybody wants and everybody loves. And, you know, we've seen a lot of duochromes that have tried to replicate this. And I think that they're good and everything. But this one comes with the Mama Pat formula. And I wanted to share it with somebody. And so... Whoever wins this uh, giveaway will also have a Divine Rose too. And I'm really proud because it's so pretty. And I just know that you guys will love it. And so, again, I wanted to be able to pick up the things that I really, really loved. And so um, Pat McGrath had to be in the box. And, yeah, I'm excited about this one. I'm so excited about this one. I hope that you guys love it. I know you will love it. Um, if you've never experienced Pat McGrath's formula, like you're in for a treat. And um, the last part is um, I have a couple like little gifts that I've received in PR. I think I showed one, but one of them, I think I promised this earlier in another video, is um, a Shantikai uh, little gift. It comes with, um, I think this one is with, is it the BioLift? It's either the BioLift series of deluxe samples or it is with the Gold Eye Regenerizing, Regenerizing, um, set of samples. I have lived off of these deluxe samples. I know I sound ghetto as hell, but I have because they're expensive. And so I've been living off of these samples that my uh, my buddy, my homie, my buddy Scott sends me um, anytime I place an order or whatever, you know? And so um, I think that you will get a really good, like, you know, two to three weeks worth of use out of these deluxe samples so that you can experience it and see if Shantikai is something that you're interested in. So I had set one aside because I wanted somebody to try this. 
So this they say is valued at about $50, but you know, whatever it's, it's a gift with purchase, but I wanted to save one for you guys. And then the last one I was kind of stuck on. So I'll tell you why. And if you guys want the other one, I can totally try to fit it in the box, but, um, this one is more fat, more flat and fits better. So just let me know, but it's just a gift from my buddy at Dior. He's always sending me nice little things like this. And so I wanted to share some because we can't use everything. You know what I'm saying? Like we got to share. And so um, this is uh, what it is. It's a limited edition. Um, one of these like canvas bags. I love it because you can throw a ton of makeup in here, but you can, um, but you can um, still wipe it down because of the material. It's like a pleather type of material and you can wipe it down if it gets dirty with your makeup. So I really, really liked it. It's a lot easier to package, but you have the option between this one or like a faux leather brush case. I also got an extra one of these because I purchased a ton of quince. And so it's a Christian Dior brush case. You kind of just set your brushes in there and then just zip it up for travel, which is really, really cool. Um, whoever wins will have the option to choose what they want. Um, so yeah, those that that can be included as well. Um, I have a new one. It's not this one. This is mine, but I just wanted to show it. So um, yeah, Woo. I feel like I just hauled a ton of stuff, but I did. And I did this for somebody. So uh, you know, this is the stuff that you can expect. I think that, did we add, did we tally everything up? 50 plus. So the value of the giveaway box is $908. Now I promised a thousand dollar giveaway box for a thousand subscribers. And the reason why we're at 908, not that I need to give a reason, but I want to, cause you guys are so lovely is because shipping is going to be a shit ton. <laughs> It's going to be a lot and it's okay. I don't care. That's my gift to one of you. Um, I think more than anything, like I just want to show you guys how appreciative I am. Um, people that know me in per like in my normal life, they know like I'm an extravagant giver. I love to give like, this is my thing. This is my love language. This is how I show love. And, um, yeah, I just want when you guys are watching my videos like, oh, hey, I have that. Like, let's pull it because we're going to deviate a little bit from a lot of the new new reviews. I think that for me, I can't speak for all of you, but for me, it's been a little bit exhausting and I just can't keep up with it. And I don't want to like I want to play with makeup. I want to talk to people that love makeup and I will have some new because I'm still going to buy, but not at the volumes at which I have so far. Um, so it'd be cool. Like, Hey guys, we're going to have a live tonight. Pull your divine rose too. pull your Sydney grace. Like that's cool, you know? And so, um, yeah, that's kind of what the premise behind it was. And I just wanted people to be able to just kind of have fun with me and have fun with makeup. Um, I kind of ran late with doing this live, but I'm glad that we're doing it now because the giveaway closes December 18th. I'm leaving it open for 30 days. I'm doing that because it's a big giveaway and I want to give everybody the best opportunity to win this stuff. Um, and I don't want to leave anybody out, you know, so give people a chance to watch the replay and see what they can do to win this giveaway. Um, let's talk about the rules. And did I write the rules down? I'm the worst at rules. I want to give everybody everything away for free. Cause I don't know. I don't know why I do that. But anyway, there's rules guys, because it's a big giveaway and because I want to continue to get my channel out there and share it with other people. Like, obviously that's a goal. I want to continue to grow. So there's a four rules. I'm not going to make it too hard, but they have to be followed exactly as I give them because again, we want everybody to have an opportunity. And if people are, doing exactly you know what is asked in the giveaway and then others are not or kind of like that's not fair right so the rules are number one duh <laughs> duh you must be subscribed to my youtube channel do i need to say that i i mean we kind of do because sometimes youtube will play these games on us and like you know they unsubscribe us from channels it's happened to me before i know that you guys have mentioned that also so um, you have to be subscribed to my YouTube channel and with subscribing to the YouTube channel, 
Make sure and hit the notification bell for all notifications so that you're always alerted. Also, this will let you know when the giveaway announcement comes up. So um, make sure that that's done. Subscribe to my YouTube channel, notifications hit to all. In order for me to verify that you are subscribed to my YouTube channel, please, please, please do this because it pains me when I do giveaways and your profile is set to private. Please set your profile to public. Like nothing crazy is gonna happen, especially if you're not a creator and you're just somebody that enjoys YouTube. Set your profile to public so that I can verify that you are subscribed to my YouTube channel. Um, in the past, you know, we've kind of, I even went out of my way to like go and DM these people and say, hey, please, please go to public. And sometimes they see my message, sometimes they don't. And I just wanna make sure that you guys have every opportunity. Set your YouTube profile to public. Is Bryant in the house? Excuse me. Hello. Hello. Hello, Brian. Ah, oh, you guys go follow him. He is so fabulous. This guy's in Dallas. And so like, duh, we're friends. No, but we are friends. We're building a really beautiful friendship and I love him, but he has the most amazing videos. My sister and I, for some reason or another, his Biosance review video always comes up because he made us buy every freaking thing in the line because his review was that good. Go follow Brian at the SP Nation, man. He's amazing. Thank you for coming, friend. I really appreciate that. So, <laughs> so rule number one, subscribe to my YouTube channel. Make sure your profile is public. Rule number two, go follow me on Instagram. Go follow me on Instagram. Um, that's, I think, pretty self-explanatory, but make sure and go follow me there. A lot of my giveaway rules and um, announcements are made through Instagram. And so I definitely don't want you to miss out. And so definitely go follow me there. That's where we become makeup friends. We talk about makeup all day. You can tag me. I can tag you and just kind of have conversations. So I love, love that. And rule number... Rule number three, rule number three, please share this live um, and send me a screenshot when you've shared this live on one of your socials. Um, I wanna grow, I mean, plain and simple. I want to grow our community and I would love it if you would share this live with others so that they have an opportunity to win as well. Um, I think that, you know, law of attraction, like we are attracting what we put out, like your vibe attracts your tribe. And so like, I have just been so thrilled with everybody that's a part of our community please share this live with someone, send me a screenshot via Instagram. Uh, rule number four, um, rule number four, comment, and it's gonna take a while, so I just want to, how do I do this? Hmm. Rule number four is I want you to comment down below what your favorite video of mine is since I started my YouTube channel. For some that have been subscribed for a long time, that should, you know, um, something should stand out as to what my fav your favorite video was that I did. If you haven't been subscribed that long, you know, you can go back and watch some. Definitely let me know what your favorite video was. And uh, rule, I guess there's five rules. Let me see. Yes, rule number five, when you're done with all four steps, please go and message me on Instagram with a screenshot that you shared this live um, so that I can start validating your entry. Um, you will get an additional entry if you share um, a post that I will upload in the next couple of days on my Instagram to your stories. You don't have to do that, but it's an additional entry if you'd like to be entered additionally. Um, so yeah, I think that's it. I hate that like, I, I don't want it to sound like I'm making you guys jump through all these hoops and and all that. Um, I just, I just, um, I, I am very intentional about growth. I'm very intentional about bringing the right people to our channel. And I want everybody to have an opportunity for it. Like, you know, I just, I know, and I know this is going to sound cheesy, but literally like right before my live, like I'm not a Bible thumper, but like I literally prayed and I'm like, I just want the right person to win. Like I want to bring joy to somebody that deserves it or that's having a hard time or that this could really bring joy to, you know? And so this is why I think it's so important, like share it please with somebody that you think might like it. You know, take advantage of the extra entry, which I will, um, you know, share on my Instagram. And um, definitely, um, yeah, yeah, I think that that's it. Do we have any questions? Because I think I've rambled enough. Like, what's the question? Ooh. SP Nation is going to do a giveaway when he hits 20,000. He's almost there. So everybody go subscribe to him because when he gets to 20,000, we're going to get a giveaway from SP Nation. 
Do we have any questions? Si Lunita, Pat McGrath, clever rules. Yari, thanks, doll. I thought about it a little bit. I didn't want it to be too crazy, but you know, there's a lot invested and we just want to continue to grow and have a good time. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. I'm like, yeah, I was overthinking it, but I'm just like the right person's going to win and it's going to be fun. And like, how amazing. Okay. I literally just had this idea right now, but how amazing would it be like for the person that wins? Like, hey, come on the live with me and like, let's do our makeup together with everything you got. I just get so excited. I think people will like it. So yeah, that would be amazing. I'm not going to make them, but yeah. Oh yeah, you see this, Brian? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. He made us spend way too damn much during the Sephora sale, but it was good. And I am loving my Biosense eye cream. That's all I'm gonna say. That's all I'm gonna say. So yeah, so that pretty much um, sums it up. You know, um, I if you guys have any questions, please let me know. Thank you, Tracy, for going and checking out my boy, Brian. Um, I think that you guys will love him. And um, yeah, I think I'll just finish my drink and see if you guys have any questions. Yeah, I mean, I you're always gonna have people that are only in it to win, but for the most part, I have found the most genuine and loving people here. And so, um, yeah. I'm excited. I think the right person will win. And yes, you should totally have. Oh, I know. Oh, my God. That would be so awesome. I mean, I have to respect people's privacy because I know not everybody's crazy like me, you know. But it would be so cool if they weren't like too shy and they're like, yes, I'll come on your live. Like, and it's funny because I've actually been talking about this like in the last couple of lives. Like I really, really encourage people like when we have lives, especially with like the makeup and chills, which are going to come back into rotation in December. But it's just um, like I don't care if you're a creator. I don't care if you're I don't care who you are. Like you're a powder, a part of our community. And like with this streaming service that we've got going here, like I can add anybody into the stream. Doesn't matter. You don't have to be a content creator. You don't have to be anything like if you say, hey, Yadi, like I'm doing my makeup with you. Let's do this. I'm like, uh, hello. Yes, please come on into our live. And so that's just what we like to do, like especially with everything that's happening lately. Like we're probably going to be stuck in our houses more than not. So like this is a cool way to escape for a little bit, you know, so I don't know. Jess, we are subscribing to Brian and there's a lot of creators here. So please don't be shy. Let people know you have a channel so that they can check you out. Um, Veronese, I, I have to think about it. Like that is part of the requirement. So I have to think about it. I really didn't account for that. Um, I'm going to have to get back to you. Like, I don't want to just think about something just on the spot. Like, let me get back to you because I don't want to have that be a disqualifier, but at the same time, it kind of is. Um, we'll, we'll think about it. Let me think about it, please, if that's okay. And we'll get back to you. And uh, <laughs> it would be it would be amazing to see how excited. I know that would be cool, huh? I love it. Oh my gosh. I thank you, doll. I love it. I love it. I'm so happy for you, Yadi. I've done it. Oh, thank you, Susanna. Oh, thank you. Like that's not even seriously, seriously. Like people that know me, I'm not trying to flex at all. I just like slowly picked up this, picked up that. Like you know, just to kind of make people happy. Like, it just, you know, it is what it is. So, okay, look at Pretty Psyched Beauty. She has six more subs to go for 100. Like, go check her out. This girl is unique in the beauty space. She has a makeup comedy type of channel. But one of the ones that stands out to me about um, her channel is when she did, like, this crazy, like, little scary thing. And she had all these special effects. It was cool. It was different. Like, that's what we're doing this for is to have fun. So go check out Pretty Psyched Beauty. I think you'll find her refreshing. Let me see here. Will the chat be available in the replay? I'd like to see. Oh, okay. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, Eileen. Thank you so much for asking that question. If you go back and you watch the replay, the chat will pop up real time as the questions were being asked during the live. And so, yes, definitely. Um Definitely you can see, um, but yes, I mean, a lot of these people at some point or another, yeah, a lot of these people are 
creators and they're amazing creators. Like I'm not just saying that, but like I actually watch them. So just, just, just. I'm just looking at the at the chat here, guys. I really appreciate you guys being here. I'm just again, like I'm grateful, you know. Um, I'm just grateful. That's all I'm gonna say. I don't have anything else to say. But yeah, any other questions? Any other questions? You can always reach out to me via Instagram and just ask me your questions. I'm always there. Um, with um, with Veronese. No, no. With Veronese, let me let me think. And um, if you would be so kind, um, there is an email in my about section on my channel. So definitely reach out so that I have your contact information. And I'm going to be thoughtful about it and I will figure it out because I don't want you excluded. You were such an amazing part of our chat tonight. And so um, this is what I love. I love the engagement like more than anything. Like I just want to sit here and hang out and talk makeup. So let me think about that. Um, it's so exciting. He's going to hit it so quickly. He's going to hit it so quickly. Yeah. So happy for you. Liz, thank you so much. Like I talked about her in one of my videos and it's like, you know, we, um, Liz is one of them. Molly, Molly O'Hara is one of them. Like I, they're, they don't have channels, but they're just makeup enthusiasts and they're just such amazing, good hearted people. And like, that's what I'm in it for. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's what I'm in it for because I just love people and I love makeup and, um, yeah, that's just my thing. So anyway, I, I'm not going to try to delay this any longer. I hate to leave you guys because I'm having so much fun. If you have something to talk about or if somebody wants to join me on live, we can totally just drink the night away. But I'm assuming people have lives aside from me. And um, yeah. Oh, how can we share the screenshot? How we can share the screenshot by email. You're saying like if she shares it, but how would she share it? We'll think about it. Let's be thoughtful. If you guys have good ideas on how we can help our girl Veronese out, let's do it because I'm open. I'm flexible. I don't want to leave anybody out. That's like the opposite of what we're trying to do here. We want to really bless somebody with something fun. So let's think about what would be fair and what would be fun. Okay. So anyway, thanks you guys so much. I have nothing else. If you have any other questions, find me on Instagram. You can email me, whatever you need to do. I think that that would be cool. Um, I am going to have, um, a 1000 subscriber live celebration. The giveaway closes on December 18th. I'm trying to have the live like that same day or like a day or two after, because I don't want to let it go too long because of shipping. I want to get this box out. Um, I will say, and I thought about this and like, ugh, I'm so nervous even saying this because I've gone back and forth about it, but the giveaway has to be for us and canada only um it's not necessarily like how expensive it would be to ship it like that's not it at all it's just that the uncertainty i mean even in the us we're having a lot of issues with our mail and with packages being lost and everything else and so just to kind of help control that a little bit like giveaways open for us and canada only and i'm so so sorry um i'm kind of trying to think of something like you know, what if I could do like just one special item that you choose um, and send it overseas, but it's just so difficult guys. And um, from all of the research that I did, it's just not going to be feasible. So again, my apologies. I really do. I have so much love for people overseas. I have a lot of supporters and subscribers from um, places like India and Lebanon and um, we have a lot in Switzerland and Germany. And so it just pains me. It really, really does. And if I can think of something special or a giveaway where, um, you know, we can make it a more compact package that is not easily lost or damaged, like maybe we can open up a giveaway to you guys. I just, I appreciate you guys so much. And I don't want you to think that I'm excluding you. It's just really hard. But I just had to say that it's really difficult for me. But um, I hope you understand. I just know that I love you. And as soon as we can figure something out that works, I will definitely make sure and include you all in that as well. Um, but yeah, that's all I got. Please, everybody have an amazing, amazing night. I'm going to after the 
video processes, it usually takes like a long time, like 12 to 14 hours for the video to process. I will be leaving the giveaway rules in a pinned comment, but I will also go back and add them into the description now. So if you don't remember exactly what those are, I'll leave them in the description box below. All of the items that we talked about are linked in my description box. However, I will also be adding uh, a section with all of the makeup that I'm wearing today. Think you guys really liked the lipstick, so definitely we'll include that. And um, yeah, so so happy. If you liked what you saw, give me a like. Make sure and subscribe. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter. I love you guys so so much. Um, I'm hoping that the 5,000 subscriber giveaway will be bigger and broader and will encompass the entire world. So thank you, thank you, love you. Keep sharing, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.